Good defending. Gets his foot in there. Atkinson. Three minutes to be added on. It's good play until they got that challenge in. There's good progress with this attack. Well, the referee has signaled for half time, and it's. The second half is off and underway. It goes out wide again. Tremendous understanding from these players. Well, spoke too soon, I guess. They were moving the ball around nicely, but now they've lost it. Short passes, but they're keeping the ball. Came in with the challenge, and the ball broke free. They spread it out wide here. Chance to get some width into this attack. They've coped with it well defensively. Well, they've been trying to get this deal done for some time, I gather, Alan, but it's now completed for Bayern Munich. Yeah, and I think both parties will be absolutely delighted. I think uh, he'll have a successful career at his new club and around £45 million. I think that's money well spent. Will Atkinson. Penalty at Barnsley. It's a penalty for Barnsley. A slight delay as the ref clears the defenders. Little run, and he slipped and he screwed the ball wide. Didn't even make the goalkeeper make a save. 54 minutes played. It remains 1-1. One, one. Oh, interesting news again from Alan McInally. Thanks, Alan. There's some potential in this move. And it'll go into the middle now. And the keeper can collect this one. gone out for a throw in Leonard Well, they're building steadily here, working away. Came in with a challenge. There's going to be a throw-in after that tackle.
Trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation. And now the shot. Good stop by the goalkeeper. Decision. is a throw, it's a fair tackle. Attacking well here. Patience is the name of the game at the moment. Played into the middle. Defender to it first. Challenges for the ball. Attacking now. Stopping the cross. Important job for the defender. Corner. For Portsmouth. Number four, Anthony Ridgeworth. To be replaced by number eight, Michael Tillman. Here comes the cross. And he heads it for goal. What a good hit at it, but I'm afraid that was off the radar. position they've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now just a heavy touch the opposition could take the ball away just a quick check on the clock and there are 20 minutes to go well this is an opportunity when you concede a free kick in an area like this you could be in serious trouble Well, they've got a lead to hang on to, the away team here. And they're trying to do it, I think, by running down the clock whenever possible. And you can tell the home fans are frustrated with their team and with the tactics here. Yeah, you can understand it. Every opportunity the away team gets, they will slow the game down, take time with their injuries. And uh, it is frustrating for the home team and crowd. Robinson. In quickly. Moving forward with some danger to the opposition now they're here. Well, they're still battling to try and get their search for supremacy successful. Possession facts suggest that the <laughs> battling is still going on. That's all right. One thing having possession, but another thing. Saw the goal and went for it. A oh, great work by the keeper. Oh, yet another great stop. I think he's going to earn a clean sheet here if it carries on like this. Oh, penalty. No question. 
Well, sometimes we talk about the double whammy, but it's a single whammy here. It's just a penalty. Yeah, the player concerned looked a little relieved. I think he thought he was going to see yellow there. He's done the job. He's the specialist. Without turning a hair, he made it look easy. Yeah, it is. And uh, he doesn't normally let you down from 12 yards. Certainly didn't there. So, and that's a foul. And uh, they'll get a free kick for that. He's coming forward with some danger. This with a chance to go into the lead now. Well, that has cost him, but only a corner. It could have been worse. It's 82 minutes played now. And he's up for the header. Oh, how much difference that could have made. Well, I don't know whether nerves got the better of him because he was aware of how important it was to score there. Could be dangerous. Very well done with the inside of the head as well as the outside. Good pass. And in he goes with the tackle. That's a good challenge. Promising build-up until that challenge. Well, he's cleared the danger. Cox. Closing moments of a thrilling game. But one more attack, one more goal. That could do the trick. Just seen the board there, Alan. Four minutes of added time. Well, there's a little buzz done around the stadium because... They realise that should be enough to get home and hosed. Into the attacking third. Well, this is how this team can play. Sustained attacking football, but when they lose it, as they've done... It's a late free kick here. These days, going off your feet like that is running the risk of the referee taking serious action. Well, he's gone to ground, and whenever that happens, you're going to get penalised. Poor challenge. He's got his shot off now. Oh, the tension's starting to rise. It's a corner. He's going to try his luck. He's tried tremendous... English Football League 1, Barnsley 2, Plymouth Argyle 1, Bradford City 2, Oxford United 0, Bristol Rovers 0, AFC Wimbledon 2, Burton Albion 1, Chesterfield 1, Bury 2, Hilton Keynes Dons 1, Coventry City 2, Rotherham United 1, Gillingham 1, Blackpool 1, Notts County, 2, Millwall, 0. Oldham Athletic, 1, Walsall, 2. Sheffield United, 1, Rochdale, 2. Southend United, 1, Portsmouth, 1. Swindon Town, 2, Port Vale, 1. So what do those results mean to the league table?
Well, this is a game from the League One. I'm Martin Tyler, and Alan Smith is with me. Pleasure to be here, Martin. Can't wait. Game today is Portsmouth against Berry. And here is the Portsmouth lineup for this game. And it's interesting, they've got three at the back and three up front. It's quite an unusual formation, isn't it? You don't often see it. It's going to be interesting to see how it pans out here. But uh, I think the manager has got an option to switch, maybe go back to uh, foot. And shoots! Oh, that sipped on past the keeper, but just past the post. Onto the attack now. Well, we know the qualities of this home team today, Alan, don't we? They're so strong defensively. Best defensive record in the league. Well, some people call this side boring, but not for me, because uh, they just love their clean sheets, don't they? And in goes the cross. And it's behind for the goal kick. Nice bit of interplay between these two. He's coming forward with some danger to put them in front. When he went, just diverted it away. He's used his head there to keep his side in possession. They've got the ball back by that interception. Just a heavy touch, the opposition could take the ball away. see what he was trying to do just stretch the opposition by getting the ball out wide but it's gone out for a throw stopped emphatically and just as well the approach play looked very encouraging well this attack has got a bit of menace to it then in the shot go was he going just too fast to be able to control it at the end, the shot was awful, really, after a wonderful run. He's missed it by a mile. I, I just cannot believe that he's fluffed his lines like that. A timely challenge. And it's gone out of play there. Patience is the name of the game at the moment. Some options now for the pass. It was nicely worked until that point when it broke down. Now they've got to try and regain possession. Could be dangerous. And they've cut it out. Trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation. Well, this is certainly going to be within their range now that the free kick has been given. The keeper refusing to be overpowered here. What a shot. Portsmouth have a corner. There's the ball in.
they've coped with it well and they've scored now and the significance is that they're in front great goal well talk about luck the keeper makes a good save but straight into the path of the attacker let's see the replay now So the first goal, it's 1-0. Mayer. Now Lee. News of a goal from AFC Wimbledon. It's a goal for AFC Wimbledon. 33 minutes played, 1-0. Cheers, Alan. And shoots! And the goalkeeper got a touch to that. Fine save. That's a corner. Well, he was in the right place at the right time to cut it out. Came in with a challenge. Here's a chance to attack. Going for goal! A well saved. Caddis. Good play until they got that challenge in. Referee sees that as a foul, and it is a free kick. Jacob Mellis in quickly. Good reading of the play, anticipating the pass. Doing well to keep the ball. Good play. But they've lost the ball now, and the opposition could get at them. Three minutes to be added on. And in he goes with the tackle. Good position. They've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now. So here we go for the second half. Vaughan. Into the attacking third. Played into the middle. Caddis. Now Lee. Played down the wing, keeping the wide attack going. Well, this is how this team can play. Sustained attacking football, but when they lose it, as they've done now, it's just a risk that they might get caught out. Well, they're in a good position here. That's great defending there, stopping that attack. Short passes, but they're keeping the ball. And now the shot! Gone for goal in spectacular style. Well, I was expecting him to be wheeling away in celebration there. Could be dangerous. Promising build-up until that challenge.
gets his foot in there. Good interception. There's going to be a substitution. It's for the away team. We've had an hour gone here, and still 30 minutes left. There's some potential in this move. That's a turnover. A possession here. Goal news from AFC Wimbledon. It's the second goal for AFC Wimbledon. 63 minutes played, 2-0. Oh. He's got his shot off now. Oh, what a fine goal. They lead by two now. They'll feel a little bit more comfortable. And they're good value for this advantage at the moment. Well, they've got a goal to show for their excellent performance in a game where really we expected it to be very tight. Yeah, and I didn't quite know what to expect coming into it in terms of who was going to win. But uh, the leading side is there on merit. Restarting at 2 0. Jacob Mellis. And the away team want to make a change. Oh, the attacker's done well, beaten his man. Oh, the referee's given the penalty. More problems now. They've conceded a penalty. Well, that's the last thing they needed. They weren't playing well, but to give the opposition that, criminal. And scores from the spot. done the job yeah he's a man you can depend on in these situations because he does keep a clear and cool head well here's the goal again well they've widened the margin now 3-0 they lead camera good position they've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now the shot's on it was a good side of goal, but he skied it. Manager thinking for the away side, time for a change. 20 minutes of the 90 still to play. Moving forward with some danger to the opposition, now they're here. Not rushing it here, moving from one side to the other. Well, that would be a throw. And it's time for a change now up front. And the one goal that he scored isn't going to spare him getting substituted here. No, he's played his part, but that time in the match now where his manager, I think, wants a, an injection of pace just to try and stretch those defenders. Working hard just to see maybe a sight of goal. And the cross is in. Shot on! Oh, he had a real go. Well, you can't knock him. He was in the right place at the right time. Just couldn't uh, provide the finishing touch. Trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation. Baker. Well, good through ball. That's great defending there, stopping that attack. It's going to be a substitution. It's for the away team.
decision is a throw. It's a fair tackle. There's some potential in this move. Coming onto the pitch, number six, Anthony Kay. And they've cut it out. A real chance here. A well saved. Corner coming up. And it's a heading chance now. Excellent header, probably deserved a bit better from it. Yeah, he's one of the best headers of the ball in this league, I think. Well, I'll be honest with you, this last few minutes have dragged a little bit from where we're sitting because the game as a contest is long, long over. Uh, all credit to the team that's winning. Uh, I'm afraid not too much credit to the other side. Made the challenge well. It's a good place to win the ball here. to the attack now well the flag's up and he's frustrated because he is caught offside maybe he made his run a bit too soon doesn't need to go as soon as he did that well the board's gone up there's going to be four extra minutes Clark just spotted the ball up and they're playing He's coming forward with some danger. And it's the goalkeeper's ball, quite clearly a wasted cross. And Portsmouth have won as the final whistle goes. Well, we've seen a game here. English Football League 1, AFC Wimbledon 2, Bradford City 1, Blackpool 1, Notts County 2, Chesterfield 3, Gillingham 0, Millwall 1, Barnsley 0, Milton Keynes Dons 3, Bristol Rovers 0, Oxford United 1, Burton Albion 1, Plymouth Argyle 0, Coventry City 1, Port Vale, 1, Southend United, 2, Portsmouth, 3, Bury, 0, Rochdale, 2, Swindon Town, 1, Rotherham United, 1, Walsall, 2, Sheffield United, 1, Oldham Athletic, 1. Let's have a look at what those results mean for tonight's league tables. At the top of the table, we have new leaders in Portsmouth with 16 points. In second, Bradford City with 13 points. In third, Rochdale with 13 points. In fourth, AFC Wimbledon with 13 points. In fifth, Notts County with 13 points. In sixth, Barnsley with 12 points. In seventh, Chesterfield with 10 points. In eighth, Burton Albion with 10 points. Bottom of the table, Bristol Rovers with two points. And then, reading up the table, second bottom, Gillingham, with two points. Third bottom, Sheffield United, with two points. Fourth bottom, Berry with four points. Fifth bottom, Plymouth Argyle, with four points.
Hi there, Alan Smith. Hi there to everybody from both of us. And welcome to this big match today. We've got Bristol Rovers here against Portsmouth. Portsmouth, very happy with their recent form. The last game they won against Berry. Yeah, 3-0. Comfortable for them, and uh, they're flying at the moment. I think they'll win again. Well, this is how the home team shape up. Two banks of four. 4-4-2. Four, four, yeah, how it always used to be. Don't see it quite so often these days, but uh, that's a classic formation and uh, really capable of causing problems here today. And here is the Portsmouth lineup for this game. And, and here comes the counter-attack. Shots on here. But in the end, it's nowhere near the target. Rose. A timely challenge. Goal news from Notts County. It's a goal for Chesterfield. Seven minutes played, 1-0. Oh, interesting news again from Alan. To put them in front. Well, they've broken through here with a really good goal. And the celebrations reflect that. The supporters are going crazy. It's a terrific moment for the team. Well, it is the way the modern game is played, isn't it? This kind of breakaway. And they couldn't live with them. Well, if you've got pace, as this side have, you're always going to be a threat on the counter. It's a wonderful finish. Good position. They've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now just working away to try and find an opening let go that's a good spot by the defender I know the supporters are going to try and do their best to lift the home team today because they've seen them lose three in a row yeah they need the help of the crowd and uh, they need to raise the games because uh, collectively it's been poor let go Referees officiating properly here within the laws of the game. Quite entitled to give that as a free kick. Although early, sometimes the players expect to get away with it, I think. Well, you can't knock him. He was in the right place at the right time. Just couldn't uh, provide the finishing touch. A draw will do as we look at the table to allow the visiting team to go to the top. But obviously they'd love to do more than that and win the match here. But it's a, a nice fallback position for them. You're right. It's early days, Martin, but they've started the season really well. They'll certainly want to continue that here today. Came in with the challenge and the ball broke free. Trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation. Look how quick he reacted. And that goalkeeper can just saunter out and pick that up. Some potential in this move. And now the shot. He's kept it out. Let go. Hit the post. Read the play well to intercept. Rose. That looked very good indeed, but the move has broken down. Attacking now. A timely challenge. To bring them level. And that's the goal that's brought them level. A 
and that has just lays it into the corner unstoppable and that's a goal well worth analyzing again it is uh, level both sides have scored here now here's a chance to attack oh he's totally totally done the defender Defender to it first. Clark! That's come off the goalkeeper, still in play. He's had a go here. Shot blocked here. Promising build-up until that challenge Rose Leko probing away trying to find room for a shot maybe brilliant team play this with the passing the movement off the ball to make the passing possible to the attack now makes a challenge here and the cross is in that didn't cause too much confusion that cross in the end Rose Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. He's going to cross it. Well, that looked promising, but he's been stopped. Well, only two more minutes to be added on by the referee now. Rose. Lecco. Well, the referee is blown for half time. Substitution, for Substitute coming on. Coming it's a tactical pitch. change. Ball is moving again for the start of the second half. Now Brown, played down the wing, keeping the wide attack going, trying to find an opening, not panicking, shot on, and it's a header, oh he was in for another goal there, but the goalkeeper this time got the better of him. Yeah, it looked for all the world like the striker was going to beat the keeper again, but well that goal he had other ideas. In quickly, Rose into the attacking third and shoots and they're desperate to try and change this game it's been level and now they're pushing on looking for the goal that will take them in front that is a tackle and a half off it's a very good interception could be dangerous to more 
Here's Brown. This could be a chance. Saw the goal and went for it. No, no, no. Well, the defenders could only watch and pray because they've been left for dead. But he just couldn't finish it. Rose. Really on top of their game now. Wonderful understanding. Well, he's got away from him. More. Lecco. Well, this attack has got a bit of menace to it. Well, he'll want to clear his lines here, but make sure it's a bit more than just hoofing it upfield. Here's Brown. Good reading of the by anticipating the pass. That looked dangerous until he made the interception. Trying to switch on the... Attacking power in this situation. Never quite as simple as you think to throw the ball to one of your teammates. And here we've got a free kick given by the referee. Kyle Bennett. And Evans. On the attack here. Well, they're building steadily here, working away. News of a goal from Bradford. It's a second goal for MK Dons. 68 minutes played. 2-1. Thank you very much, Alan. And out wide, they were in a good position until that defender acted very promptly and decisively. Good challenge here. Mansell. Now it goes into the wider areas where they've got a winger waiting. 20 minutes of the 90 still to play. On to the attack now. They cope with it well defensively. Rose. Please return to your vehicle immediately. Thank you. Good forward play from them. Possession changes feet. Portsmouth give away the free kick. Time ticking on. Just over 15 minutes to go. Into the attacking third. And there's the interception. That attack was looking good. Now the opposition have a chance. A goal from uh, Walsall. It's a second goal for Walsall. 79 minutes played. 2 1. Thanks, Alan. Well, we're in the last knockings of the game, but we're still on the edge of our seats here. It's that close. Kyle Bennett. Good position, they've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looked very encouraging. Christian Montano. 
possession in the midfield area. Good through pass. Excellent play to lose his marker. Mansell. Through pass. Well, they've been uh, thwarted here. That's a sign of better things to come. And in he goes with the tackle. Now Brown. Really on top of their game now. Wonderful understanding. And here's the shot. Low. Well, only two more minutes to be added on by the referee now. This could to take the lead. Hit the post. And uh, the game drawing to a close. Rose. There's a chance for Portsmouth to win the game here in these dying moments. And that's how it's finished at 1-1 here. Well, it was a very well contested. Seven minutes played. Champions Cup. Chelsea 3, Olympic Lyonnais 1. Bayern Munich 3, Valencia 0. Harry Saint Germain 1, Ajax 1. Anderlecht 1, Liverpool 1. Zenit 0, Tottenham Hotspur 2. English Football League 1, Barnsley 2, Blackpool 1. Bradford City 1, Milton Keynes Dons 2. Bristol Rovers 1, Portsmouth 1. Burton Albion 2, AFC Wimbledon 2. Bury 0, Port Vale 1. Coventry City 1, Milton.
very warm welcome to you to Fratton Park. I'm Martin Tyler and Alan Smith is alongside me. The game today is Portsmouth against Bradford City. Portsmouth back in action again after their last game, which was away, and they drew against Bristol Rovers. Yeah, arguably the better team in that 1-1 draw, and I think they'll be the better team here. Well, you don't win anything, Alan, do you, for being top at this stage of the season, but it's uh, quite a, an experience to enjoy, particularly for the fans when the league table is published, and they will go top if they win. Yes, an awful long way to go, of course, but it would send a message, I think, to their rivals in this uh, campaign that they're here for the long haul. And here is the Portsmouth lineup for this game. And it's interesting, they've got three at the back and three up front. It's quite an unusual formation, isn't it? You don't often see it. It's going to be interesting to see how it pans out here. But uh, I think the manager has got an option to switch, maybe go back to uh, four at the back if he wants to. This is the away team lineup. We've got it down as a 4 3 3. Yeah, it's a system that the Netherlands used to use all the time. I think really they invented it and uh, plenty of countries have adopted it since. If it works, it's, it's really uh, tough to handle. Attacking well here. There's the ball in. Defender to it first. Challenges for the ball. Good pass, getting it forward. Little headed pass then, and a shrewd one. Shot on! He's got to it. And he's claimed the ball too. Working hard just to see maybe a sight of goal. Promising build up until that challenge to Jones. He'll need to try and get the ball back now. Clark. On the attack here. One back very quickly. What we've got here, Alan, is the away team. A little dip in form, two defeats in a row. Well, it's, uh, it's kind of run that you, you can endure during the course of a season, but I just want to make sure it doesn't go on for too long. And in he goes with the tackle. Trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation. And the ball knocked away long. Tries the through pass. Came in with the challenge and the ball broke free. In with a chance. Corner for Portsmouth. It's good play until they got that challenge in. Throw for Portsmouth. Comes in with a tackle.
Yo, what's up? Career mode king. I don't know if you can find it yet. Trying to find I don't a way know through why. here. Probing away. Jones. I'll check it for this game though. Attacking now. That's a passing game. And my word, they're passing it well here. What? Portsmouth throw. And it's a shot now. A well saved. And that's a corner for Portsmouth. Did you go to the soft game? Short passes. How is it? Keeping the ball. He's looking for the cross. Well, that's a clever <laughs> pass. Good defending. <laughs> and Jones. Burgess. Taking it well under pressure. Goal news from right. Chesterfield. It's a goal for Chesterfield. Yeah, I don't know. 30 minutes played, 1-1. One, one. Thank you very much, Alan. Into the attacking third. And the cross comes in now. Oh, Brian. You. Yeah. Couldn't keep it. The pass not completed, really. We could be in. And here's the shot. He's kept it out. And there it is, the goal. And it's... Put them into the lead. And that has opened the scoring. 1-0 here. Here's a goal from Chesterfield. It's the second goal for Barnsley. 36 minutes played, 2-1. Cheers, Alan. Did well, stuck out a foot and cut off the pass. Is this guy trying to get his girlfriend to play it? Sammy? Now is regained by Portsmouth. <laughs> oh, the one in the house? It was good progress with this attack. I heard about it. One of those Good said it did really well. To make that interception and clear the ball away. Goal news involving Rochdale. It's a goal for Bury. It's been scored by James Vaughan. The keeper had made a fantastic save from the original shot, but could not stop him from tapping home the rebound. 41 minutes played. 1-1. One, one. Oh, interesting news again from Alan McInally. Thanks, Alan. Trying to find an opening. Not panicking. He's got his tackle in. And the ball's gone out now. Attacking well here. Now here, he's had a go here. Yeah. Pick his spot now. Great work by the goalkeeper. The ball is his, and he's made sure he's protected it. We've got two added minutes. That's been signaled now. Spotted well by the defender, cut it out. My expectation for this season is actually really hard. It said you have to get automatic Last promotion, so I have to get nil. first. <laughs> yeah, I stay first. Yeah. That's how the referee's happy, and the second half gets underway. I'm like two points clear. But everyone's super close. With five, six teams out. Like three, two points on the line. I'm about to lose this one already. Great interplay. To bring them level. Oh, well, let's go. The, the redhead. Even the team that have conceded it, I think, have recognized that they've been on the receiving end of much of this game. 
but they were hoping they could hold on they haven't been able to do that and now they'll be concerned as to whether there'll be another goal in this match it will see them beat let's see fantastic from the neutral point of view that the game is level again well there's a goal worth replaying over and over again isn't it the red rocket himself so away we go at one all Tony Strepko and LeBron have been going at it this series. It's looking good this move. He can cross it now. Yeah. The shot's on! Ooh, By the standards of this game, him. that was a great chance. He was never going to be a match of uh, lots of scoring opportunities and he might live to regret that one. Yeah, it's annoying that they didn't. Because of my here, keeping possession. He's coming forward. With some danger. And here's the shot. Oh. oh, a good goal. And now they're a goal to the good. And we restart the game 2 1. Matthew Kilgallen. He's in strongly. Really strong tackle, and the ball's gone out for a throw. Goal news from AFC Wimbledon. It's a goal for Gillingham. 56 minutes, please. 1-0. Surely, the equaliser. That had equaliser written all over it. Well, when you see him this season, he's finished harder chances than that. I don't think he can believe it. On to the attack now. Probing away. Trying to find room for a shot, maybe. Quick change of possession here. Little private game between the two of them. And it's been an hour of very good football here. It's a quick break. Defender to it first. One back very quick. substitution here for the home side now they've got a no. chance shots on here oh off target at such a crucial can't even trade my goal because if he gets to like 85 or higher or something like head. then he's gonna want to leave because we're only being the championship at that point <laughs> so i'm just like not doing it i'm training everyone else that passing is top class and that tackle has got in the ball Yeah, I, I only need one. I'm not going to use anyone else. Like, I really don't. I'm trying to get, like, a defender. Goal potentially special. That's all I really Rochdale. want. It's a Maybe one more attack. 69 minutes, please. 2-1. Thanks, Alan. Good position. They've worked this attack very well. Into a quite a dangerous position now. 20 minutes of the 90 still to play. Some players limbering up for the away team. Substitution in the offing. Trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation. Well, this is how this team can play. Sustained attacking football. But when they lose it, as they've done now, it's just a risk that they might get caught out. And the cross coming in. And he's kept the ball out of the penalty area with that block, the defender. And this will be a Portsmouth corner. <laughs> That's a free kick. No 
time to panic. There's still time to change this game. I think this is going to be kitchen sink time, Martin, now. Plenty of long balls into the box, trying to get on those knockdowns. Into the attacking third. Oh, God, man. Not that well. Out of boy Lingazine. And it's a shot now. Oh, the pressure of getting his team level maybe got to him because he's made a hash of it. I just wonder whether at the end of this match they'll look back on that chance as the one that cost them dearly. Well, we've had some chances. Alan, but it's while since we've had a goal. They've still got the lead. Yeah, and they're knocking the ball about. Let go. Oh, great work by the uh, That was it. Well, we're in the last knockings of the game, but we're still on the edge of our I guess I did a bunch of it's random ones just so I have some well, extra in players in case you need them. One of these guys turned out to be insane. He's like better than like all my guys. Yeah, he's like, he can, if I put him in the starting line, he'd be like second best. <laughs> it's a late free kick here. <laughs> For the ref, a decision, and the decision is yellow. I don't think anybody, least of all the player, can have any complaints about that. Foul. Challenge. Nothing. <laughs> Marshall. Wasteful pass, unforced error, really. Three minutes from the referee by the fourth official. That's the decision regarding added time. Well, he's threaded the pass through neatly. Here, the challenge is a good one. Yes. And there is the final win. Dang, Costa can say. What else? You prodigy. English Football League 1. AFC Wimbledon 0. Gillingham 1. Blackpool 1. Coventry City 1. Chesterfield 1. Barnsley 3. Millwall 0. Walsall 3. Milton Keynes Dons 2, Burton Albion 1. Oxford United 1, Notts County 1. Plymouth Argyle 0, Rotherham United 2. Port Vale 1, Bristol Rovers 1. Portsmouth 2, Bradford City 1. Rochdale 2, Bury 2. Sheffield United 2, Southend United 2.